Hi everyone and welcome back for another video on how to use MyPal to automate tasks at work. Today we are going to build a workflow to turn any YouTube video into lecture content. This would be very useful if you are a student wanting to learn from a lot of YouTube videos or if you are an educator or a creator who want to repurpose a given a piece of YouTube video into educational content. Let's see how um, this workflow is constructed. It first, uh, it is first triggered by a YouTube video. This is very obvious. Uh, make sure to select uh, URL as the viewed type in this case. Now, after the YouTube video is provided, we will execute a chain of three steps. The specifics of uh, the steps as well as wh what is included or how each step is constructed may depend on um, whatever you see fit. But for now, this is our recommended uh, way um, of uh, doing this. We can start with analyzing the YouTube video first to extract the key insights or key learnings from the YouTube video. In this case, I have a side to my YouTube video analysis, which is an agent that I have uh, prompted to uh, for it to be excellent at summarizing YouTube videos. I also uh, don't forget to give the YouTube video as uh, a data uh, in the prompt. So this is simple, uh, just uh, click, uh, Add, and you will have will see this YouTube video just selected, and this data will be provided to the step. After that, we will design the structure of the lecture, and in this case, I will not only give the YouTube video transcript, but also the video analysis uh, prepared by the previous step. Then, lastly, would be the content development step where we will combine everything we have um, we have like analyzed from the and extracted from the YouTube video um, of uh, prior steps into a full uh, piece of lecture content. Now, that's a walkthrough of how uh, this workflow is constructed. What we can do now is to actually run this workflow to see how it works. Let's go back to our Thread Studio and click uh, and select the uh, workflow turn YouTube video into lecture content that we have built together. Now, uh, we would be prompted to provide a YouTube video. In this case, I have uh, just randomly select one of my uh, one of uh, the uh, video lectures from Y Combinator. So just uh, copy the link and paste it here. Start reading the URL, and within seconds, my pal will uh, successfully learn the URL. Let's start the workflow. Okay, this workflow starts with analyzing the YouTube video. Then it starts to um, construct the lecture structure. And lastly, it provides the content development, the final content development uh, about the topic of building an MVP in startups, just like in the video. And, also, and it has provided a full scale lecture on this topic with the key points elaborated clearly, examples as well as conclusion. Uh, so within, within like under a minute, we have got our content, lecture content right here. Now, uh, if you uh, like this kind of workflow, uh, please uh, go to brain.myproduct space and try building this workflow for yourself. And please feel free to uh, tweak uh, here and there in the prompts or in the uh, step structure so that the workflow can uh, behave the way that you see fit the most. Uh, so I hope you like today's tutorial and I will see you in our next videos.